there was something in one of Bryce's songs that I wanted to read to you from the book, um, which is that this is basically like a punk rock tour diary for 1918 and not very punk rock. Um, it's, uh, so Lorette was, they kept doing things to try to get more money. They were selling autographed programs and stuff. and. Um, the audiences would say like, oh, we'll imitate this famous actor, and Lorette would totally jump through the hoop and do it. And then they'd say, oh, how about this guy? How about this person? Do that, do the president. And she would do it and do it and do it and make more money, and then she got a really bad review for having done it. And um, is there anybody here who's ever gotten a bad review published in the newspaper? <laughs> yeah, okay, so here's how you can respond to this. This is a great way to respond to a bad review. So she starts out and says, my heart is broken. Someone said my cabaret stunt was not dignified. <laughs> so here's where I speak my mind. I doubt very much whether the men who are fighting for us appear dignified as they fall in the mud, shot through, <laughs> having made of themselves a human wall between the Hun and us. It's the cause they think of, not how they look. <laughs> So suggested that it was not consistent with the dignified future I hoped to make for myself on the American stage. There will be no future for anybody on any